So qualifications went well yesterday. It was a little bit of a messy routine by my standards, but it still got the job done, still made the final, and that's the main thing. I was happy with my mindset during that competition yesterday. I feel like I was very switched on. Even with the mistakes that I made, I knew how to save those mistakes pretty well. And it was a really late competition. I was the last subdivision of the day. There was a lot of waiting about all day, and um, you know, I didn't eat at the right time because I really couldn't because the competition was kind of at dinner time or a little bit after dinner time. So there's about seven and a half hours there where I didn't eat since lunch. But those are the type of things that we prepare for, really. The organization of competitions never goes exactly to plan, so you gotta prepare to have that organization be rearranged quite a lot. I had a morning session today and because it was within 12 hours of the last time I competed or had a session really, I was pretty tired. But the thinking behind that is that would have more time to recover from now until the competition tomorrow. So it was a little bit sluggish, but I was kind of just refreshing the cues that are in my head for my routine. And I'm feeling ready for tomorrow. I think I'll be a lot more fresh tomorrow and I look forward to that freshness. A little bit of post-competition commentary from me on Adam and Eamon's performances because they're constantly in the videos and you guys uh, are always asking about them. Eamon hit his floor routine. It's a, it's a new routine for him so there was just a few landings that needed adjusted. Just similar to myself, it's the start of the year. There's a lot of things that need ironed out and that's hopefully going to get ironed out for him in the next competition in Doha. Adam went out just to compete on palm horse, dust off the cobwebs, his first competition back after the surgery and he smashed the routine. It was really good to see him go out there, compete confidently, get that much needed competition experience in from a year off of competition for him. And hopefully that'll just keep him juicy and confident in training and in future competitions when we're building up for these Olympic qualifiers. His Olympic qualification route is different from mine and Eamon's. So these competitions aren't really important for him. European Championships is the important one for his all around qualification to Worlds. All right, it's uh, finals day. Just have my second shower of the day. I don't know why I do that. On competition days, I always really enjoy showers. And if you're not from Northern Ireland, what I'm saying is shower. There's just something really comforting about it to me. <laughs> there would be like some days when I'm competing and I'd be like later in the evening and I genuinely have like three to four showers in that one day. Strange, I know, but I'm feeling pretty ready for the competition today. I feel relaxed. The timing of, of the competition is a lot more familiar to me than it was the qualifications. It's like a similar timing to how I would normally train like in the middle of the day. So I'll not have a rumbling tummy like I did at qualifications during my routine. So I'm wanting to hit some areas of improvements and the routine today uh, just hitting like the cues that I have in my head that I maybe didn't hit in qualifications that's why the routine is a little bit more messy I just come out with a really good execution score really well actually execution score aside just executing the skills how I normally train them So a bit of a disappointing performance by myself. I hit the pointers that I wanted to improve on from qualifications, but then some of the other skills fell to the wayside. The leg split on the Russian travel was the big falter in that routine. And um, 
it's a shame really because the routine up until that point was uh, quite strong and was on for a good score. So uh, no medal, no podium placing today but the good news is we got some points in the World Cup series to then qualify to the World Championships and that's really the main goal of this World Cup series as well as getting competition experience which was also achieved. It's snowing right now in Germany and uh, I'm looking forward to traveling to Doha where it is not snowing and it is probably about 30 degrees warmer. So I hope you've enjoyed the video. I'm gonna sign it off there, go back to my room, analyze the routine, see where I went wrong and improve it for the next competition. So follow me then and hopefully we can place back on that podium and perform some good routines and good gymnastics. I'll catch you later.